We got it. We're going down. It's too heavy. What's going on, everybody? Z here. Welcome back to some more Trail Makers. So today we are going to play with our new propeller provides propulsive power. Yes, indeed. We're going to provide we're going to we're going to play. We're going to play with that. We're going to try to make ourselves some kind of helicopter thing. I don't know. We'll see how it goes. But yes, thank you so much for coming back. Hopefully you're having a wonderful day. If you are, make sure you leave a like on the video. And if you're new here, maybe consider subscribing as well. So it is under cover of darkness, unfortunately. So I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to start building this. And hopefully by the time I get something built here, uh, maybe just maybe we will be able to uh, kind of see what's going on and maybe give our test flight. Oh, I'm super excited. All right. So I threw a little something together here. I don't think it's going to work, honestly. But hey, you know what? We'll find out. Oh, my gosh, it's actually working. Oh, my gosh, it's actually kind of working. No way. Does turning work? Okay, kind of does. Kind of does. Not really. Okay, I think it's because they're both spinning the same way. Oh my gosh. Uh, yeah, I think it's kind of working. It's kind of working. Oh my gosh, it's kind of working. It's kind of working. It's kind of working. Uh, all right, hold on. It's coming nice and slow here. Okay. Uh, let's see. Turning capabilities is non-existent. So let's see here. Um, maybe I have these backwards. Let me, let me see if I have these backwards. Okay. So let's try that one. Oh gosh. No, not even close. Not even close. Not even close to being right. <laughs> okay. So maybe instead of having both of them on there, Hmm. Maybe I should just have one that's in control of that. So let's do this. Let's move you. Can we put that right there? Hmm, we could. And then we could have it. So I'm guessing, uh, whoops, that's not what I wanted. Uh, my guess is that A up is propulsion this way. So for this one, propulsion this way should turn us to the left. So this should be left. This should be right. And this should be the exact opposite, which it is. Okay. So let's see. Let's, uh, let's move this out by one. Let's try to keep things equal here and let's throw this in here just to get them all connected up. Now the problem is that the back end is a lot more heavier than the front. So it's going to, it's going to naturally fall backwards like that. Okay. So, uh, we're going to need a weight probably. How much do these things weigh? 12.5 and 12.5. What do we have for balance weights here? 12.5, 30 is a little much. 30 is a little much for that. All right, let's see how bad it is now. There's still more weight in the back than there is the front, but it's not as much. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nope, this isn't going to work at all. And crash and burn. <laughs> okay, all right, all right, we'll get this. We'll get this. Man, it's kind of like it's gotta be like perfectly weighted. You know, I'm actually kind of curious to see why this doesn't work. Like it, it definitely works. Oh, and I lost my I lost my thruster there. Or I lost a propeller. Okay, so everything's perfectly weighted. Now the only problem is if we want to be like make this thing useful. We're going to need some kind of uh, we're going to need some kind of lifting capabilities and that's going to throw weight off of everything. I mean, it's working. Uh, we don't have a way to balance ourselves out, unfortunately. Oh, yeah, we got it. We kind of do. We kind of do. OK. All right, this is this is kind of working.
We don't have a lot of control over it, though. You know, I'm thinking we need that gimbal jet. Because I had people commenting and they said the gimbal jet, uh, like, constantly provides downward thrust. So let's see if we can find a gimbal jet. All right, so I know where one's at. I know where the gimbal jet is at. Oh, gosh. Oh, darn it. <laughs> this is exciting. Okay. All right. I know where the gimbal jet's at. I mean, we have a little bit of control over this. I can kind of, I can get to where I need to go. It's just not the moje most majestic flight in the world, you know? Like, I don't know what this is. I don't know what we're doing this for. But we need to go backwards. Oh, shoot. Okay, well, let's rotate around. Whoop! No! 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 <laughs> this is not great. This is not great. This is not great. Not great. Not great. Okay. Okay. All right. We're fine. Everything's fine. Okay. Perfect. Nope. 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 Stop. 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 Stop it. No. Yeah. Okay. All right. Come on. Come on. Come on. This is not what we wanted. Oh, geez. We're having a bad time. Okay. Flip to save us. Yes. Okay. All right. Come on. Come on, baby. Come on. We can do this together. Okay. All right. We, we may have, we may have crashed and died. Don't tell me I'm back all the way. No, I'm all the way back to where I started. <sighs> That's unfortunate. Is there a gyro in this game? Sometimes gyros like are what we need to solve the problems for everything. All right, we're going to take a quick land. Perfect. Rebuild. That way we don't have to start all the way over from the other place. <laughs> okay. Right, let's get over here. All right. So apparently the gimbal jet is in this hole somewhere. So we're going to take a peek and we're going to see what we need to do to get it out of here. Uh, Is it in there? Negative 22. Wait a second. That's underwater. Which means we can take our submarine. <laughs> okay, we're going to save this as um, Heli Chopper. Perfect. Okay, so let's load up our... Let's load up this guy. And let's take a dive in here. Hello. Um, We're going to see if we can get this out of here. Are you the gimbal jet that I've been told of? You know, I gotta say, I like uh, I like the underwater <laughs> better than the flying. <laughs> I can control it. It's nice. Gimbal jet. That's what we're here for. Uh, do we have it? Are we good? I think we're good. All right, let's float up and let's see how we have to get out of here. Now I can see a cave right there. I'm gonna guess that's the way out. Yes, this looks like the way out. Okay, all right. What does a gimbal jet do? I'm hoping it acts like, like a, a gyro or something to kind of like stabilize us maybe. That'd be pretty nice. Uh oh, does this not go anywhere? Oh no, it totally does. Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'm so excited about this. Oh look at there's a thing right here. We haven't even activated it yet. And a gimbal jet. Okay. This block is a crucial part of your spaceship. Nice. Alright, so let's load in our other vehicle again. Let's load this guy in here. Now, a gimbal jet. What do you actually do? A jet that always fires downwards. Honestly, I feel like that would be better than these. You know what I mean? 
Like, I feel like that's going to keep us, like, level. Oh, they're super tiny, though. They are not very big. Okay, let's throw these on here and let's see what happens. Okay, so there's those. These should be on what? Spacebar? Heck yeah. Okay. Oh my gosh. Uh, <laughs> those have a lot more power. Wow, do those have a lot more power. Okay, so we need to keep weight on the bottom of this. All right, we're gonna go crashing. Okay, so this thing, I think we need to have the weight on the bottom. This needs to be on the top. That way the weight's down here hanging down lower because it's naturally going to try to keep the weight lower like a pendulum. So we need to build this a little bit differently. Let me go ahead and let's just delete all of this stuff. I like that those are only one. That's crazy. Okay, so let's delete those. Uh, this is giving us a basic frame to work with now. Let's go ahead and let's put in... Okay, so we need controls. Okay, so I did something like this a little bit. We, we threw some skis on. I didn't put them on much weight down below. Um, and then, basically, I left the propellers up here because these are going to give us our thrust, but these are going to give us our control. So we're going to have to mess with all these and get these all set up too. But that should give us some control. And then I want to put a magnet down here. So we can uh, we can grab stuff. We can like you know get magnets and whatnots, or get like the parts and stuff, and then hopefully lift them off, take them to the area, and then call it good. Hopefully, I don't know. This could be a bad idea. All right, let's try it. Let's see how it goes. Okay, not very well. Not very well. I mean, it's working. And I have a lot, I have much more control over it than I have ever had. Uh, kind of. Hmm, yeah, something's not right here. All right, so I did some changes to this thing. Uh, I, I made the, uh, the jets out wider to give it a little bit more, uh, a little bit more stability. And it worked for that. However, the rotors and stuff, the, the, the propellers, they don't really work like they're supposed to. Now, the turning is backwards, but it works for a little bit, and then it just, like, kind of starts going crazy. Like, it gets it gets very, very fast, very quick. Like, look at this. Now I can't even stop it. We're kind of like, eh. Okay, so um, I'm thinking what we're actually going to have to do is we might actually need to use, since we have these uh, gimbal jets now, we might actually need to use some type of, like, um, Instead of trying to propel ourselves by moving the rear up and moving forward, we might actually need to just straight up use propulsion pushing this way to go forward, this way to go back, and uh, we might just have to use that. So, I don't know. We're going to have to see here. All right, some more adjustments. I decided to use the mini thrusters, and I actually doubled up on these. The reason for that is because a set of these is gonna be always on, just lower power, and then we're gonna have another set that's gonna be like high power. So if I turn these on, this should get us up a little bit. Okay, so that's not enough power. Okay, so those front ones don't have enough power, or the they don't have enough power yet. So we're just gonna go ahead and re-swap these out. I'm gonna turn the power up just a little bit by a little bit, because I want them to like stabilize, but not necessarily give us lift, if that makes any sense. Um. Actually, that might not even be possible because in order to stabilize if the front gets too heavy, it's going to have to provide more lift in order to bring up the front. Uh, I don't know if this is going to work. I need like a logic controller. Um, okay. Let's turn these up to 0.4 and let's see how this goes. All right, let's try that. Yeah, see, it's really not stabilizing us a whole lot of anything because they, they don't provide enough power to stabilize. Huh. Because if I hit forward, it's just gonna. Uh. Yeah. 
this isn't really working out too hot. I mean, the controls are good. And like, if I keep on, if I keep on the space bar, then it's fine. But like, it's not great. You know, it's not great. I was hoping that those, those would give us a little bit more stability. Well, I'm gonna, I'll pop them up a little bit more. Cause if I could get it just to where they're, they're not quite giving us lift. But just stabilize, but that's not going to work. They, they'd have to kick on and off. All right. How's that? 0. 0.6. Okay. Oh, it's keeping us aloft. And it has enough to fight back on the thrusters. Then we can slow down and it will level us out. Ooh. This might this might this might actually be okay. This might work. Well let's get over here and let's see what we got on these things. What do we have here? Let's try to get something here. You know what? It actually almost works good enough. Uh, a four by eight block. All right. All right. Let's try to move. Let's try to move our first block here. This is going to be bad. Um, I need you. Oh, and of course it's going to be offset. Okay. We'll do two of them. All right. Let's, uh, turn on the, turn on the stabilizers. I guess we'll call them. Um, oh yeah, that's a, that's a boomy boomy one. Um, hold on. We're going to have to change the button for these. Cause I'm using space bar for something else for the, the thrust. That's not going to work out for us. So let's do two on those. Okay. So turn on the thrust. We're going to go ahead and turn on number two. We're going to try to swoop right in over the top of this. Okay, we got it. All right, so this is our first our first trial run of actually moving with this thing. We're moving something. It's a little rocky, but it's, it is working. Okay, so this is going to be the trick right here, is getting it into this thing. Yes, we got it! <laughs> okay, okay, okay. So that worked. So you know what that means. We should be able to go up to the islands. And we can get up that. We can crawl altitude super fast because of our, uh, our thrusty boys. All right, so let's try to get over to these islands and see what's, let's see what we got over here. You know, I think it might also be a good idea to throw some fins on here to give us some like aerodynamics a little bit, but I mean, hey, we're a floating block right now. I don't know why the screen's all shaky. It's kind of, uh, it's kind of weird. Oh, wow. These are huge blocks. These are like huge, huge blocks. I don't think we're going to be able to move these. We're going to try. Oh yeah, there's no way. That thing's bigger than my than this thing. I mean, I don't know. These do have a little these do have quite a bit of oomph on them. Let's see what it is. Oh, it's an operator seat. Uh, we need that. Okay, we're going to try. We're going to try. Uh oh, no, no, no. Okay, we got it. We got it. We got it. We're going down. It's too heavy. Cannot control. Okay, let's see if we can bring it down steady. 
Oh yeah, nope. I don't think we're gonna bring it down steady. Okay, if I can just get it over an area, like say this one, this might we might actually be able to do this. Oh my gosh, this might actually work. This might actually work. Come on, we just gotta go this way. So we just gotta get it over land. Oh, come on. Should we drop it? No, it's gonna go into the water. Actually, it might not be going in the water. <gasps> it's still down there. Let's go check it out. Oh, I can see it. I think we're gonna watch it go into the water though. And it just went into the water. Fantastic. Okay, so we might be able to make this happen if I get more of the little thrusty boys on here. I don't know if I can do that though. What's this other thing? The operator seat's super cool, but like, that's not really gonna like help us, I don't think. I don't think it's gonna give us any additional options. What is this one right here? A helicopter blade? Well, I want that one too. Helicopter blade? Well, we need a helicopter engine though. That's what we need to get this stuff out of here is helicopter. Big, big, huge helicopter stuff. All right, we're gonna try to grab this one. We're gonna try. We'll see what happens. Okay. Just gonna drag it off. Uh oh, I'm broken. Uh oh, that means we lost the thruster. Oh, you know what? Okay, <laughs> that's not gonna happen. <laughs> uh, let's just reset this. Okay, we're gonna slowly try not to break anything. We're gonna break stuff for sure. Maybe. Come on, baby. Come on. Okay, all we have to do is get it in the center-ish of the island. That's all we have to do. If we can just get it centered so it can't roll away into the water, we'll be good. Of course, it's gonna go straight into the water. You know, like I have the huge island right there, but I can't, I can't get over to it. Yeah, it says not gonna be able to do anything. And it's gonna reset because I'm gonna bail. Well, darn it. All right, so what I'm going to do here is we're going to make uh, we're going to make this a vehicle. Hold on. Um, so this is helicopter. Uh, we're going to save this one as. I don't know. Steady. Sure. Save. But then what I'm going to do is I'm going to go through and I'm actually going to adjust these. Um. So like a high thrust. So actually what we'll do is we'll fly up to that area. And then I will, uh, I will change the one option instead of 0.6 thrust. We'll put it at hundred percent thrust. So that way once we get on it and latch to it, we can turn that on and it'll be like full thrust. And then maybe we'll be able to control with the other stuff. I don't know. We'll have to see. <laughs> we'll have to see. All right, perfect. So we are up here. We're going to go ahead and adjust all of these to 100% power. And we're gonna see if that'll give us any changes. Okay, so turn our magnet. 
get over here. Grab onto it. Uh oh. Okay. No, I hit the wrong button. <gasps> no, it, why did it bring me back all the way down here? All right, here we go. Let's do this again. Okay. Magnets are on. This isn't going to work, but I want to try it. Okay. Oh my gosh. I think we're actually lifting it. I think we're lifting it. I think we're just spinning out. Nope, but we're slowly taking it down. Okay, I'm going to try to put some reverse thrust on here. <laughs> you know, honestly, I could probably drop it. Oh, gosh. I'm going to drop it. Because that's a valley right there. All right. Should be good. Okay, it's here. We got it. All we do is have to get it to the thing. And all I need to do for that is just swap out my uh, swap out my vehicle real quick. We'll just swap out to, um, what are we going to swap out to? Swap out to this guy. And look at that. We've got an operator seat. I'm pretty sure that's for helicopters. So there's one done and down. So if I go ahead and grab this guy, yep, delete my old creation. Uh, delete this. No, 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 no. I want to delete just the seat. We'll go in here and we'll grab a seat, operator seat, upright seat with stick controls for the pilot. Ah, uh, and of course it's a two square cent. You know what? Forget it. I'm not, it's not even worth it. We'll just leave that in here. Okay. So let's go ahead. Let's go grab the other thing. I mean, that worked out. It wasn't great. It wasn't great. And honestly, these, I don't think these did a whole lot of anything, mm, but still it was good. It worked. Oh, what's this one? I know the other one is the helicopter blade. Let's see what this guy is. What are you? Uh, that's a spaceship cockpit. We need that. We are going to need that. Uh, but I gotta go through and bump all these back up to 100% power. And we're going to save this one as a thrust. Perfect. So now we can load the regular one or load the uh, this one in. Okay, so let's go ahead and let's grab. Oh, I forget how much how much more of a pain it is to do this manually. Oh, come on. Why does it already? I didn't even touch it. Ugh. Stop rolling away already. Why is it already rolling away? Stop it. Go get it when it goes by. Maybe. Hey, okay, we got it. We got it. I don't know. I don't think we're controlling hardly anything though right now. Yeah, let's go this way. Over the island. Oh gosh, you know what? We might as well be... Bombs away. We're gonna go with it. This could go very badly. It might work though. Oh my gosh, what if it just goes in by itself? That'd be amazing. Uh, solid gonna hit that curb right there. heck yeah <laughs> all we have to do is drop him off the ledge oh it might actually even go 
Are you going to go in by yourself? Maybe. Oh my gosh. It's working. It's actually working. Swap this in. Good to go. Oh my gosh. It's actually working. This is a spaceship cockpit too. This is, this is like, this is a big deal. And there it is. Spaceship cockpit unlocked. 79% complete. Oh my goodness. Oh, this is exciting. It's actually working. So the machine thing is working kind of, um, allowing us just to basically drop it from that island. Now, it's not giving us a lot of control, so if we actually had to take it from somewhere and, like, move it a lot, we we probably, we're going to have to get something better. But um, we're doing the things, we're doing the stuff, and I got to say, this is pretty fun. I'm enjoying it. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed. That is going to end this episode. But, yes, there is our, there's our contraption. It's working temporarily. It is working. It's working. It's just not, not the greatest not the greatest of the things but yes thank you so much for coming out hopefully you had a fantastic time if you want to check out your own makers i have a link down below as always but thank you again have a wonderful rest of your day and i will see you in the next one Mastoff! off